What's happening, folks? I'm back with another reaction, back with some more Duran Duran, and we're going back to their 2021 album, Future Past, and let me just once again reiterate um, how powerfully and impressively the title tune of the album, Future Past, hit me. Um, go check my reaction to that if you're interested, but honestly, that is a brilliant tune. It was probably my favorite on the album so far, um, although I've liked all of them so far, which I feel like, again, I'm just going to keep saying that. Like, I haven't heard a tune by them where I'm like, eh, you know, I might make a pass. And here's the thing. I'm one of the biggest Depeche Mode fans th that I know anyway. Um, I've been listening to their music my entire life. There are occasionally a Depeche Mode, uh, there is occasionally a Depeche Mode song where it's like, eh, you know, I don't like it quite as much as the others. So um, the fact that I haven't really encountered one of those from Duran Duran so far is a testament to their quality. Don't get me wrong, fellow Depe Depeche Mode fans, I am not criticizing the band we all love. Um, I'm just saying that, yeah, you know, most of their songs really hit me in a powerful way. Every once in a while there's one that hasn't really um, struck me to the same degree, uh, but so far the Duran Duran songs I've been listening to have really made an impact. In particular, a few of them I've done in the last couple of days, so um, yeah, shout out to them again. Um, I love that 40 years after they got their start, they're still with the same sort of um, creative um, abilities, still with the same instrumental abilities. Um, it's just brilliant. So, yeah, we're gonna listen to the sixth tune on Future Past. It's called Velvet Newton. Um, I don't really know what to uh, expect with a title like that. Um, obviously, Newton, you know, makes you think of someone like Sir Isaac Newton, but Velvet is an interesting descriptor or modifier to put in front of that, so we'll have to see what this is all about. But yeah, this is Velvet Newton from Duran Duran on their Future Past album 2021. This is how it starts. interesting to follow, you know, the epic sort of grand and passionate um, future past with the really sort of like groovy and, you know, electronic sort of synth heavy uh, number. I love that. And again, it makes me think about album composition and the way that you decide to make a, 
a series of songs, like a progression um, and a particular sequence to be experienced rather than just, you know, oh, here's a bunch of songs that we're just throwing into a bag, shaking them up, and there's your album. Um, yeah, I love that. That was brilliant. Um, you know, and as someone who listens to a lot of techno and trance and uh, other electronic music styles, um, it's always going to be enjoyable to me, a tune like that. Admittedly, house actually isn't one of the genres that I pursue all that much. A little bit acid house, and because I'm a huge fan of acid music, I will always be thankful to the godfather of acid music, which is acid house. Um, you know, initially in the States, and then um, much more sort of expansively as it made its way over to the UK in the second summer of love and all that. Um, but yeah, that was brilliant. I really enjoyed that. And again, I love the placement of the song within the album. I'll now be very interested to see what album or what tune comes next. And I think as you may have noticed, it segued right into the beginning of the next tune. So I don't know, perhaps when I um, come back to the react to the next track, I'll go like 10 seconds to the end of this track and sort of let it do that segue again. Um, but yeah, brilliant. I love it. Like, again, I, there probably won't be a tune where I'm like, oh, I really didn't like that. There might be one where like, yeah, that maybe wasn't my favorite. Um, but it just seems like they really do have a sense of how to compose songs and how to capture that Duran Duran sound. Again, this being 40 years after the self-titled um, debut album, which incidentally I just ordered. Um, it's supposed to be here tomorrow. So um, yeah, some, uh, like three or four different people have now mentioned Tel Aviv as a track that I should really check out, which I, one of, one of the people mentioned that, um, there's like the, it's one of the, what is it, the Royal um, Philharmonic Orchestra, um, so yeah, basically there's some orchestral sounds in it, from what I, uh, understand, really looking forward to that, um, I did just get the wedding album, <clears throat> excuse me, so, um, whether it's that, or All You Need Is Now, or, you know, just wanting to give me a heads up about a tune that I've still yet to encounter on this album, um, looking forward to hearing from all the Duran Duran fans. I appreciate you immensely. Uh, yeah, thank you for listening and watching, and I will see you next time. Peace.